Hi, this is Andy with Condi Systems, and today I'd like to show you how to use the Layout Manager in Corel Draw. The first thing we need to do is, once you have everything designed, you need to click on Window, come down to Dockers, and go to Object Manager. Now from here, I can see the different layers that I have in Corel. This is not something people normally see, but I can click on the plus here and I can see each one of these objects as I select an object here, you'll notice it's highlighting it on the object manager. Any object I select. It also gives me an idea of what I have. We've got four rectangles and an artistic text. Now, there's a couple of things we can do here. I can actually create a new layer. I can name the layer whatever I want to. And then I can actually take images and I can drag them onto that new layer. Now, that doesn't really affect how it is here until I start to go playing with my layers. If I bring this layer down below the other, you'll notice it's taking it below the object. So if I take the green, we'll say, I want to put my layer back on top. And let's say I take this green and I move it up into my layer, it puts it on top of the yellow because it's above the image here it's going to be above since this layer is above this layer these objects are going to be above these objects there's a couple more things you can do here you notice there's some icons here if I click on the eye listed in the icon you'll notice I can no longer see these objects they're still there I just can't see them and if I bring them back up I can now see them again I can click on the print and whenever I go to print You'll notice in the print preview, the objects from, from my layer no longer show up in the print. They will not print because I have it closed out. Another thing I can do is I can go back, change the edit. So now I can't even select these objects. I can select the objects behind it, but I cannot select anything on the layer that I've closed off the editing for. Uh, this would be especially good if you're trying to do guidelines for something. I could actually create an object. I'll make it a red outline and a clear object. And I can take that object, put it on a layer by itself, and then I can make it to where that object does not print and cannot be edited. So from here, I can't select this object, but I can use it as a guideline to line up anything that I want to line up. Move things around as I want to. And you'll notice if I go to print, my red outline is not there. Alright, if you have any questions about this or anything else we have here at Condi Systems, give me a call to one 800 826-6332, option 2 for the first available tech, or send us an email to support at condi.com. Thank you.